everybody and welcome back to the Gamer Donny channel. I'm Gamer Donny and this is American Truck Simulator. Today we're going to continue with trying to fix up our old rusty Peterbilt and get a company going. We've got a load that goes from Cheyenne up to Laramie. It's a 1955 Bel Air. When we pull in the other light custom car hauling trailer with uh, the old rusty P. Um, it's got a N14, what is it, 300 and something horsepower? N14, 330 horsepower with a 13 speed. Um, yeah, we're going to be going to Lermy, so. The 55 Bel Air. So let's go ahead and get started. We're going to make a stop off by the repair shop. Um, we've got to add a couple things to the truck here. And maybe possibly change a few things. Um, right now we're working on a goal of trying to buy our own trailer. We either want a custom car hauling trailer, a featherlight custom car hauling trailer, or a dry bulk trailer. Those two trailers are going to pay the most with the loads. Um, but besides the oversized loads, it's going to pay pretty good too. But um, those trailers are like a hundred and something thousand. So we need about 70,000 bucks so we can get our trailer and... Uh, we're only at 10,000, so we got to haul some loads. This load right here pays 20 something thousand, I think. That was 17,000, so that'll help us out with our goal of getting, uh, getting enough money to buy the trailer. So let's start this bad boy up and get on the road. Pulling out of here. Let's have a look at the outside. She ain't much to look at, but we'll get her fixed up though. Stretched, dropped, lowered. Big old beefy engine in her. You'll get there eventually. It's just gonna take a while. I don't know if we get that damn car haul and that custom car haul and trailer, but it won't take too long. I do a run down to Mexico, to the bottom of Mexico, and we'll have two or three, two or three hundred thousand. It'll be a hell of a run, It'll be like seven hundred something miles, two thousand miles. <laughs> I almost couldn't get over that speed bump.
the next biggest engine, the next biggest in 14 engine cost. In 14. Apparently got that one. We go all the way up to, there's a 600 horsepower one. Uh, 730 horsepower, that's $13,000. Let's check out transmission. We get a little uh, higher geared transmission, we'd be doing all right. We're going to have a 13 speed. It's got a 3.36 in it now. A 5.83, that's a bit much. Um, what has it got in it? 3.36. We go with a 370 or a 411. Let's try a 370. Gonna knock our top seat down, but build accelerate faster. All right, hanging items. Um, oh man, that's right. I don't have the thing installed. Hold on a second. I'll grab it. All right. Took a bit longer than what I thought it was going to. I had to take it home too. Now, well, oh well, could shit be? Oh, we just put picture. Nope. Custom. The one, but I'm a little doggy. Okay, now we can get back to bucking. Maybe if the game doesn't crash. No, okay. There we are. Oh, try stick. You'd like to ship on these things in real life. That'd be a pain in the ass, wouldn't it? Got your high, your low, your range, and your split. Uh. That was a fail. This way right here, huh?
thing doesn't weigh that much, does it? 22,000. Like a fly on the back of an elephant. That only has three legs. driver. Look at, but she sounds good though. Buttons 
getting wore out. Pushing it doesn't do it.
higher gear we're in in this thing you know i got to i can climb a hill a hell of a lot better and accelerate better but i ain't got much on the top end Should have went with a 375 instead of a It's going to take a minute or two to get used to. car dealer. We just got a new 1955 Bel Air in perfect condition. There we go. Old nasty rusty Pete doing it again. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and leave a comment down below. We'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.